Hey guys, it's Simmy Cheese here, back with another video, and on today's video, I will be showing you how to get older versions of Scratch. So let's hop right into it. First thing you want to do is open up the link in description, as you can see, which is right here, Scratch Offline Editor. So this method will only work for the offline editor if you're trying to get an old version of Scratch. So as you can see, you can get Scratch 3.0, 2.0, or 1.4. So if you scroll down, you can get older versions but if you just want to download 3.0 it's for windows mac os chrome os and android so as you can see you can get it from microsoft or direct download i would recommend direct download for everything it's a lot easier so if we go down to an older versions which we're going to use i guess i'm going to go with scratch 2.0 and all i got to do is go to windows download and as you can see it's starting right there now once it's done all you want to do is just click on it and it says opening in 8 seconds. Okay, for Mac users, the latest version of Scratch 2.0 requires Adobe Air 20. To upgrade to Adobe Air manually, go to here. So then I will do a tutorial on that after I do the Windows method. So we'll hop right into that after I finish this method. So as you can see in Scratch, Scratch 2, please wait. As you can see, Scratch 2.0, offline editor. Install Adobe Air 32.0 required. So make sure that's on. So I'm going to leave a shortcut on my desktop, which is going to be pretty easy. So I agree, and it's going to ask if you want this app to make changes to your device. Press yes. That's the only way it can install. As you can see, it says installing applications. So if we just run through this quickly, as you can see, it's still installing. It might take a little bit based on how fast your computer is, your Wi-Fi is, but mine is pretty much installed. And right, there it is. So. Here it is, Scratch 2.0 Offline Editor for you guys. So, as you can see, it works perfectly fine, just like the Scratch that we used to have before 3.0. So that's how we get offline versions of Scratch. Now let's go into the Mac method here. All right, guys. So this is the Mac method for downloading Scratch 2.0 on your Mac. So first thing you want to do is go to the link in, into the description again. And if you're already there, then that's a okay. So as you can see, I'm on Scratch 2.0, and first thing you want to do is download it here. So click on the here. It's going to ask you for Adobe Air. So now you want to download. So this is from the official Adobe Air website. So it's going to say you download. Download should start shortly. And there it is, as you can see on my screen. And then if I click on it, or actually I should press next, and then it said thank you. So now it's actually opening up Adobe Air. And as you can see, double click Adobe Air installer, and then go open, because this is Adobe, which is needed to run Scratch 2.0. So installer. So this is just like uh, Scratch 2.0 on Windows. So installing, you're going to need your admin, username, and password for this. As you can see, now it is installing. So now Scratch 2.0 needs to install after this installs. So once you have installed this, finish, you can eject this little thing, just like this. And now we can open back up Google Chrome, go back to the link in the description. And as you can see, now we can download it. So Scratch 2.0 Offline Editor. And now we can go to Mac OS 10.5 and older. Download and now scratch 461.air. So once this downloads, then we can open it and we can run it. So the offline editor can update itself with user permission. So that's all you have to do if you want to keep yours updated scratch 3.0 or 2.0 or 1.4. So now let's open up scratch 461.air. Press open. And as you can see, it should be loading up right now application install are you sure you want to install this on the computer so just press press install continue and it should be installing right now once it's done you should see it right there i would recommend options keep in dock and that is how you get the scratch 2.0 offline editor on your computer in 2020 and scratch 1.4 so thank you guys so much for watching this video if you enjoyed it make sure to subscribe like and comment and i'll see you in my next video Goodbye.